Welcome back, artistic family. How are you guys? I am still stuffed. <laughs> Thanksgiving was in Canada uh, on, uh, well, the official day was Monday, which is today. Um, but most people celebrated on Sunday, which I did. Thank you for everyone who um, gave me some Thanksgiving shout outs. I appreciate that. What I have here is my black. Okay, and this here has three parts Floetrol to one part paint. My gold and a Liquitex gloss printing medium, of course, a squirt. That's my uh, one part. I also have my two parts paint and my one part Liquitex in here. I do have a mound consistency. Okay, as you can see. And here I have my white, which is titanium white. Again, one part Liquitex, gloss pouring medium, water to thin. The only difference is in the black. The black has the flow trough. So today, guys, I have a new base color. So what I have here quickly is some Liquitex black oxide. And I have that mixed in with probably just a squirt, maybe a squirt or two, I'd say, of the Artist Soft Body White just to lighten it up. And it's a gorgeous color gray that looks so great with yellow tones. Beautiful with yellow tones. So what I want to do today with this, guys, is a cool design swipe. Uh, I kind of have this kind of curvy, somewhat of a half S design that I want to do. Like one part up this way and kind of cross over one part down here. I want negative space. And I have some ideas for this color combo, so this is kind of my tester to see how everything um, works out while it's layered. So let's go ahead, guys, and get going. Okay, so I am taking the paint off the canvas. A lot of times when I do swipes, if you guys watch me frequently, you know that I often um, leave some wiggle room. I'm not doing that today. And the reason why is I do have a specific design in mind. And with that being said, I don't want to ruin um, the design. And whatever cells come through, I don't know how it will work with this new base mix. Again, every change that you make in fluid art affects everything that you do small or large there are tons of variables absolutely tons oh that's that's a pretty color guys let me try to get rid of that glare for you i can't believe i did this again i am so glad i caught this before the swipe guys so i'm going to use um my magnet i want to apply a lot of pressure and i will be doing in the near future a tutorial on various swiping tools and how they affect your cells and lacing. Okay. I want to go over like this, just like that. I do see some small ones starting to come through. We'll see what happens when I torch. And that's with the magnet. So now, Let's try this with my plastic swiping tool.
Wow, artistic family. I am loving this base. You can see the shimmer in it lightly because it is the, um, the black oxide in the base. And I love that. Of course, you guys know I love my shimmer. It looks some, I, you guys may or may not agree with this. Everybody's different and it depends on your paints. But I do find silicone cells look very different than Floetrol. I have not, I did not use any silicone, but it looks like I have, like over here, like some of those cells. But I have a variety. I have ones that look like little pearl cells, like here, okay? And then I've got this really cool lacing on the oak side, which again, which is why I like to do the wispies, because that kind of helps promote that. And then this section here is just so cool, intertwined with the new background. I love it. Uh, I love the designs that I added in there. This is my favorite section right here. Oh, I just love it. I love how simplistic it is on this base. I love the curves. I love where it sits on the canvas. Yeah, yeah, this is gorgeous. I'll be uh, playing with this base coat and these colors for sure. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you all. Let's try to hit our next milestone of 15K. Please like, share, tell the mailman, uh, whoever you want. I always say the mailman thing. I just think that's funny. But uh, I am loving this. Definitely thumbs up and comment on this if you're loving this space and you want to see me do some more pours in these colors. I'm loving it. So until next time, guys, I'm going to go ahead and admire this. Stay tuned for the quick close-up. And uh, I'll see you all in the next pour.